Like most of the world's poor, Sidhu depends on farming to survive. Poor farmers like Sidhu have to compete with farmers from rich countries to sell their cotton on the world market. Si le Mali est devenu premier producteur de coton, ce n'est pas parce que les paysans aiment faire le coton. C'est simplement parce que si tu ne fais pas le coton, tu, personne ne te fait crédit des intrants, donc les engrais, les pesticides et d'autres choses dont tu as besoin pour produire aussi ton alimentation. American cotton farmers receive government subsidies that give them an upper hand on the world market. bulk of those subsidies go to big agribusiness. Les gens n'ont pas d'autre gagne ils prennent les armes, ils trouvent, ils suivent les chefs de guerre. Poverty makes fragile countries vulnerable to crime, conflict, and terrorism. The U.S. can join together with other rich countries to reduce agricultural subsidies and work for a level playing field in global trade. We can provide economic opportunities that will help make fragile countries stronger and safer. It's not simple, but we will all benefit from the change, here and there. <laughs>